Awesome. So thank you all very much. I can see people from Arusha, Tanzania, Namibia, Oshivarongo, Namibia. Um, yeah, 23 is extremely well. Yes, excited for 2024. Guys, I'm personally excited so much for 2024. Like he's from Namibia, Winduk. That's amazing. So um, I first and foremost love to thank God for this opportunity to be with you. And um, yo, I mean, God has really, really been there. You know, like without him, we are definitely nothing. So I want to thank God for you, for your family, for this time that we are sharing right now. You know, because there's so many people that wanted to be here, but unfortunately they are not here. And so um, we just need to be able to be grateful. And um, so being a Sunday also, you know, it is one of those days, yeah, that we just need to thank God. But um, I just want to remind you that you're not here by chance. And so if you're here in this meeting, I would love for you to be very keen and get to understand what is that you're called to understand, you know. And I hope that God has already opened up your mind for you to be able to get get you know what you're supposed to get from this meeting now my name's is veronica and this is me guys this was me yesterday queening you know it was a beautiful yesterday um a beautiful sunday uh, saturday yesterday that we had and so we had an event it was a high tea exclusive high tea you know for some ladies that we met on social media right now social media is amazing it is really helping us to connect to so many people and that is to say the reason i'm sharing this is because i want you to think of what we can do differently from this december going going and towards 2024 because I've come to realize there's so much demand of what we are sharing, what we are doing. And so I wasn't alone, guys. This event was in, was was organized by my all-time partner, this gorgeous lady that you see be, beside me, Kumo Kumo Mwase. And um, today we will do, be doing this session together. You know, and um, she is a retired scientist. She actually retired at age 30. Okay, you know, retired at a very young age and currently she's a six figures Anna as well. You know, she's doing amazing in the business, in business for seven years. And so we are very well equipped into sharing with you, if you're a guest, um, how you can be able to close the year 2023 and have an amazing 2024. You can see how gorgeous she is, you know. So this is the event. We had amazing ladies. You know, these ladies are professional. Some of them are stay at home moms. You know, some of them are business women, you know, but every Everybody has got a purpose. It was for women. Does not mean that if you're a gentleman here, this is meet this business is not for you. I'm just sharing you what happened yesterday. So you can see the pictures, guys. Can you see the pictures? Can you think of an event like this in your town? Um, that's why I asked, where are you listening this session from? Can we organize an, a, an amazing event? It can be for men and women, you know, but something nice as we are closing the year or maybe beginning of January, if we can have a lot of these events, guys, where people can just dress up and then come and celebrate 2023 as we are, as, as we are planning for 2024. Can you guys do that? Can you put in, I don't know, something, maybe put number one if you want to do an event like this where you want to call your people, you know, and, you know, you can organize that with your team and all that. But this was beautiful, you know. So I want to welcome Kumo, Kumo Mwase, um, and she'll be taking us through the first part of the business session. I'm sure she will inspire you so very much. And so stay to the end and get to understand what is that we do? What is it that make us fulfilled? You know, what is that? Is it that has been helping so many people from different backgrounds, from even, you know, from the, from the very low background line, you know, like we say from grass to grace. So I don't know what situation you are in like right now, financial situation, health situation, spiritual, you know, I don't know what situation you are in right now, but I will tell you, we have got amazing men and women that have got amazing stories that you will be inspired with. So Kumo, um, it is an honor to again, you know, as always share a platform with you. And I believe that this evening you're gonna be able to inspire us and inspire the guests that are here. And so guys, Ladies and gentlemen, our retired scientist, a senior manager in the marketing plan of our business, Forever Living, she has been able to achieve everything, literally everything that our company offers. And so she is the perfect person tonight to be able to show you how you can work on your goals for 2024. Kumo? Thank you so, so much, partner, for such a wonderful, wonderful introduction. We really had a great time yesterday, ladies and gentlemen. And basically what we really do in this business 
is to connect with like-minded people, show them how ca they can improve their finances and their lifestyles and just make an impact. So if you are a person that likes making an impact, then you are definitely, definitely in the right meeting tonight without wasting any more time. I'm going to open my slides. Thank you once again, Veronica Kunja, a very good business partner of mine. She forgot to mention that when she started the business, she was already a full-time stay-at-home mom with a very great income that, that she was making from the business. You know, so unlike most of us that started in corporate, Veronica never went to employment after she finished her studies in, in varsity. You know, so for me, that is absolutely inspiring because it shows that um, the success that get taught to us is people that you need to be employable, you need to be employed so you can make money and be successful. That is not the truth. So I just want to say to all of you, thank you once again for joining in on the meeting. Allow me to reintroduce myself again. My name is Kuma Mwase. I am a mother. I'm a scientist by profession, as Veronica has already mentioned. The business opportunity that we're going to be sharing with you I started it in 2016 as a side hustle. And the reason why I started this side hustle, ladies and gentlemen, was because I felt like um, I was feathering my studies, but I was not getting that salary increase I wanted. I was not getting that promotion I wanted. I was not getting that better job I wanted. And I made a decision in February, 2016, that I am going to start a side hustle. Right now we are in December, 2023, you can also make a decision that you're going to start a business and make sure that you make 2024 your year. I'm grateful that I started in 2016 because let me tell you, when 2016 started, in January 2016, I had lost so much hope. I did not even think that my life or rather my life would turn out the way it, it did by the end of 2016. I'm sharing this to show you that there is so much power in making a decision. Although I started the year on my lowest in 2016, but I ended that very same year on my highest. In actual fact, in 2017, a year after starting the side hustle, I retired from my science career to pursue the business full-time. Now, what pushed me to start this was when I saw this quote by Robert Kiyosaki saying, it is more important to grow your income and to cut your expenses. Can I just see by you typing a number two on the comment section, how many of you are here in this meeting and are constantly cutting costs because you think that you will have more money by doing that? How many of you are always cutting costs? I see there's a lot of twos. A lot of people are always cutting costs. Well, ladies and gentlemen, I am here to tell you that cutting costs is not gonna change your financial situation. But what is going to change your financial situation is when you make a decision that you are going to increase your income. And how do you do that? By adding another stream of income. And that is why we are here tonight to share with you a wonderful business opportunity that has changed so many lives. I see a lot of twos there, you know? So what motivated me to start a side hustle? If you are relating to any of these things here, type a number three so I can see if you are relating to any of these things that motivated me to start a side hustle. I got motivated to start a side hustle because I was drowning in debt. And the fact that I was drowning in debt, it affected my credit record. You know, unfortunately, we live in a country where they allow you to take things on credit. And before you know it, you are drowning in debt and you can't cope. You know, that is where I was financially. And I, it, I had to admit that I'm struggling and I'm drowning in these debts. And yes, I had a salary but it was not enough, ladies and gentlemen. And as people, like I said, we are always cutting costs, but unfortunately, sometimes you get to a point where there is absolutely nothing to cut anymore. Or you get to a point where you even end up cutting the most important things in your life. For me, one of the things that I had to do to cut costs was the fact that I had to take my son to go and stay with my parents. That was the most painful separation ever. You know, because he was still very young. He was a year old. I was also diagnosed with chronic illnesses that are caused by stress. Now, I know that 
It was due to financial stress. So ladies and gentlemen, I saw a lot of threes there and definitely I am saying to you, there is a better way and we are here to show you that. Let me show you what happened when I decided to decide back in 2016. I remember in June 2016, you know, just a few months after starting this business opportunity, I made 6,700 rands from the business. I was still employed at that time. And that 6,700 rands meant a lot to me because previously I did not have it. I was one of those people that would get paid. And before the end of the day, my bank account would be empty. That is how bad my situation was. I don't know how worse yours is. I don't know where you are in your financial standing, but that is where mine was. July, 2016, I made 19,900 rands from the same business. August, 2016, I made 40,000 rands from the same business. And now for me, this showed me that actually the more efforts I put into the business, the more my income grows. And by the way, I did mention to you that I was a scientist or rather I am a qualified scientist, a retired one. But let me tell you, my salary as a scientist was not close to that 40,000 rands that I got from forever within six months of starting this business. And let me tell you, like I said, there's so much power in making a decision. Literally, you can decide after tonight that your 2024 is going to be better than your 2023. I made a decision, like I said, in January 2016, I was drowning in debt. But within six months of starting this business, I paid up all my debts. I remember I paid up my credit card. I was also one of those people that was buying clothes on credit. I paid up all those clothing accounts. I paid up my personal loan. Let me tell you something, ladies and gentlemen, there's nothing as fulfilling as being able to answer private number calls because you know it's not debt collectors asking you when are you coming to pay. You know, there's just so much power in actually knowing that you don't owe anyone. And I felt so much load being lifted off my shoulders. So I want to say to you, if you are drowning in debt, I saw there were a lot of threes when I asked. So there are definitely people that can relate and they do have debt. I want to say to you tonight, you can change your financial situation. I know because a lot of people have done it. And let me tell you, one of the reasons that I started this business and I made sure that I was going to make it work was the fact that I wanted to be able to stay with my child again. And I also wanted to afford to pay school fees for him. When I started this business, my son was three years old and I gave myself two years. I told myself that by the time my son turns five years old, I'm going to take him so he can stay with me and he can be able to go to school in, in, in Johannesburg because that is where I am based. And he now stays with me, ladies and gentlemen. So I st this business made me take goals that wouldn't have been possible had I not started. He now stays with me. That is him. I took him when he was five and did. He's 10 now. That is him and our helper. And, you know, another goal that I managed to take through this business was the fact that I managed to afford private schooling for my child. This was when he started stage five. Stage five is like early learning. Um, I'm also grateful for the fact that by the time he started stage five, I was already a stay at home mom because of this business. This is him now. He's now in grade four, same school um, that he's been in. And it's not just any private school, ladies and gentlemen. It is actually in the top 10 of the most expensive day schools in South Africa. I wouldn't have been able to afford that if it wasn't for the business. So I'm trying to show you that it is possible to make a decision and completely change your life and take goals that you probably can't do right now that they are not possible to take. Now, I want you to have a look at these two tables. The one table only has one leg that is supporting it, whereas the other table has four legs that are supporting it. The table with one leg, should that leg break, the table collapses. Whereas the table with multiple legs, should one leg break, the table will wobble, but it will remain standing. So I want you to think of these two tables as your lives and the legs of these tables. Think of them as your income streams. Right now, I want to ask you a question. 
which table are you? Are you the table that um, should you lose your current source of income, your life collapses, or are you that table that has other sources that even if you lose one source of income, you will still have other sources supporting you. Let me just see on the comment section by typing a number four. I want to see if you are table number one just with one source of income. Type a number four. If you have multiple sources of income, it can be one, it can be two, it doesn't matter. If you've got more than one, more than one type a number five. I want to see on the comment section um, how many of you are table number one, I mean, number, num uh, the first table, and how many of you are the second table. I see we've got someone with crying emojis that she's table number four. Okay, we do have people that are table number five, but then we also have other people that are mostly table number four. You, I mean, the second table. So ladies and gentlemen, those that currently have one source of income, I always say to people, do something today that your future self will thank you for. Your life in the next four to five years will be based on the decision that you are going to make from tonight or before 2023 ends. Again, I repeat, how your life is going to be three to four years from now will be based on the decision that you would have made in 2023. I am grateful because the life that I'm living right now is due to the decision that I made back in 2016. And honestly speaking, I cannot even recognize my life right now. I just want to show you um, just a few ladies and then I'll, I'll get a business opportunity. This lady, when she started the business, she's also one of our um, business community. When she started the business, she was a single mother, tired of taking the father of her child to maintenance because he wasn't paying for child maintenance. And you know what? Instead of complaining about her situation, she decided that she's going to do something about it. She started the business. She's an accountant by profession. When she started the business, she was driving a VW Polo Vivo. Again, there's absolutely nothing wrong with the Polo Vivo. It is just that as people, we've got dream cars. We want our dream cars. We want our dream houses, you know. So, But she started the business without even thinking that she'll ever drive her dream car. But through the business, ladies and gentlemen, she is now a gracious stay-at-home mom. She's a retired accountant. She's no longer working as an accountant anymore. And not only that, she bought herself a Range Rover. And quite recently, she just bought herself a BMW SUV because her Range Rover unfortunately got into an accident and it was written off. But these are ordinary people, ladies and gentlemen, that actually wanted more out of life. This lady, when she started the business, her car had just gotten repossessed. The car that she was driving before the business, it had just gotten repossessed by the bank. She was working for an insurance company and her husband is an attorney. She started the business because she wanted to supplement her household income because they had two incomes in the house, but they were not enough. She wanted to add another source of income. Through the business, she left her job at the insurance company. Not only that, she bought herself a Mercedes-Benz. By the way, her car that was repossessed by the bank is not even close to the cars that she bought through the business. Quite recently, she bought herself this BMW that she's driving. And this lady, when she started the business, was a medical student in Cuba. She's originally from Botswana. By the time she moved back to Botswana to go and practice as a medical doctor, she was already driving her dream car that she bought through the business and living in a nice fully um, furnished apartment. Last year, she had a baby and she decided that she wants to be a present mom. We all know the crazy long hours that the doctors work. So last day she decided that she wants to be a present mom. And then she decided that she is going to practice as a doctor part-time because she wants to be there full-time for her son. This is a choice that she was able to make because of the financial freedom that she got through the business. So ladies and gentlemen, those are just some of the stories, but you'll hear others much later. The business concept that we want to introduce you to tonight, I just want to say to you, for me, it was something that I thought um, I can't do. The first time I heard about network marketing and multi-level marketing, 
It was back in 2016 when I started. Before, I had never heard about it. But I know a lot of people tend to confuse it with the pyramid scheme. I just want to quickly clarify that a multi-level marketing business or a network marketing business is actually um, a marketing strategy. So this is when a company, let's say a company manufactures products. Now, instead of putting these products in shops and actually advertising them on TV and on billboards, they actually get... Uh, they actually partner with individuals to market these products for them. So as an individual, you buy these products from, a, from the company at a discount price, and then you sell them at the price that they would have given you to, of course, get your money back with profit. So in actual fact, it's like you are buying into a franchise. It's just that it is a franchise that you are getting at a lower amount. Now, in terms of our business as well, your commissions are paid on products that are moved or sold whereas in a pyramid scheme um first of all a pyramid scheme is a scam it, it usually it, it doesn't last it collapses you know and also pyramid schemes they encourage you to go and recruit people you know for you to make they encourage you to bring in lump sums of money and they tell you for you to make money you must go and bring people for you to recover your your initial investment you must go and bring people you know so pyramid schemes ladies and gentlemen don't last and they collapse for me um as a christian anything that has to do with gambling or pyramid schemes or whatever i do not subscribe to so i literally had to do my homework when I started this business. And, you know, I also loved the fact that um, there are products involved. I love the fact that also, if when you are working harder than the person that have brought you into the business, you can actually even earn more than them. Now, I just want to make examples quickly because I know there are people that are probably in, in, in traditional businesses, but I want to make an example and compare it with our kind of business. I'll, I'll make a, I'll use the hair salon as an example of a traditional business. That is because last year, a friend of mine and I wanted to invest in a hair salon and I wanted to invest in it because I just always like taking money and invest my money from my network marketing business and investing somewhere. Now, this salon, um, we both agreed that we're going to come up with 150,000 rents each, meaning we'll have 300,000. And the plan was to be able to pay our rent pay for water, pay for electricity, pay our staff, and also buy stock for the salon, buy furniture, renovate the place, you know, and make sure that we are able to run, to pay all these things, all these running costs for at least four years because we knew, I mean, four months, sorry, because we knew that we're not going to be able to make money immediately from this business. Now, my friend then decided to open the salon with her other friend in another area because she told me that she felt like, um, there's, the, the, there's more opportunity for the business to grow that side. So she opened a salon that side. And this was a year ago. I asked her about a month ago that, friend, how is, is the salon going? You know what her answer was? She said to me, Kuma, the initial investment that we took out for this hair salon, we still haven't gotten it back. That's the first thing. Secondly, every month we continue taking out a lot of money from our pockets to make sure that the salon keeps running because whether we've made money or not, we need to pay for rent, we need to pay for water, we need to pay for electricity, we need to pay our employees, we need to make sure that we've got stock. Now, imagine a business like that with a high startup fee, high running costs, and she said to me, we are even thinking of shutting it down because honestly speaking, we are not making money from it and it's been running for a year we have not even gotten our initial investment back. Now, imagine that business, they started with a lot of money, they didn't get their investment back, and now they are even shutting it down. But let me compare it with our business. Our business, the startup cost is very low. You can start with as little as um, 1,300 rands. You know, maximum is 9,300 rands, but there are other options in between. The running costs are also very, very minimal ladies and gentlemen i mean the only running cost we have is to make sure that we've got products for our clients when our clients pay us the money that we bought products with it comes back with profit we're not losing anything you know so 
Um, the other running cost is to make sure that we've got Wi-Fi like this for these meetings or just money for coffee meetings with people that you would have met. You know, so the running costs are very low compared to a traditional business. I also want to say to you that my, well, we've got different experiences, but for me, my initial investment when I started this business, I got it back within just one month. Now, which business can you start with that very low amount and you are able to get your initial investment back within such a short space of time and you are able to start making bankable income immediately? Now, I also want to compare it with employment. That is because I was previously employed. When it comes to employment, your income is fixed for 12 months. Yes, there are annual increases, but not everybody gets annual increases. But even if you do get an annual increases, we all know that those increments are so, so limited. And also, when it comes to employment, your job is not willable. Should anything happen to you, you're going to get replaced. Another thing with the business, I mean, with employment, you don't really own your time. Again, there's absolutely nothing wrong with employment. I was previously employed as well. But I used my employment as a stepping stone to build a business. What I love about our business is the fact that your income is not fixed. I showed you, all of you, my first six months in the business, how the income was. Your income increased as well. It's unkept. When I left my job, I remember that month, I earned 80,000 rands from the business. I also love the fact that the business is willable. So should anything happen to you, whoever your next of kin is, they will inherit your business, your entire network, and carry on from where you would have left off. I love the time freedom that comes with this business as well, ladies and gentlemen. And let's just hear what do the rich have to say and famous have to say about network marketing. This is Donald Trump the former president of the United States. And he was asked what he would do if he had to do it all over again. And he said, I would get into network marketing. Robert Kiyosaki, the author of Rich Dad, Poor Dad, he said, if I had to do it all over again, rather than building an all-style type of business, an all-style type of business, he means traditional businesses. There's the same traditional businesses that I was explaining to you about earlier. He says, rather than building that, he would have started building a network marketing business. And ladies and gentlemen, that is because network marketing gives people the opportunity with a very low risk and a very low financial commitment to build their own income generating assets and acquire great wealth. Now, up to so far, I hadn't mentioned the company that I am affiliated with and the company that the person that has brought you into this meeting is affiliated with. Ladies and gentlemen, we are part of a company called Forever Living Products. And I just want to give you um, a few things that made me actually partner with this company. When I started the business, the company was 38 years old then. So I loved the fact that it was not a fly by night. I didn't want to partner with the company and tomorrow I get told that it is no more, you know? So I loved the fact that it was 38 years old when I started back in 2016. It is currently now 45 years old. The company originates from the USA. Again, the company itself is debt free. You know, it's very important when you are about to get into business with, with, with a company or with someone, you need to assess the financial standing of, of, of those people or of that company because that is what will also determine the longevity of, of the business itself and the feasibility of the business working out. So I loved the fact that the company that we have partnered with is debt free. And I also love the fact that the company operates in over 160 countries, ladies and gentlemen. Now, the beautiful thing about the company operating in over 160 countries simply means that you are able to expand your business as an individual without even spending a cent. If I had a, let's say I had a, I'm going to make a hair salon as an example again. If I had a hair salon in my area, never mind in another country, if I want to expand to another area or to another country, I would need to take out money again to expand my business. Whereas here in our kind of business, you are able to expand your business without spending a cent. And that is because all you need to do is to introduce other people and coach them how to also move products just like you. Now, um, the fact that over 160 governments allowed our products to operate in their country, it shows you how good 
these products are. And we are part of the Direct Selling Association. If someone says to you, I want to introduce you to a network marketing business, please make sure that that person is actually in a company that is part of the Direct Selling Association because the Direct Selling Association actually protects you as the distributor and it also protects the consumer. But again, ladies and gentlemen, for me, out of I'm not undermining or anything, but for me, out of all the compensation plans I've seen, our company's one was the best. And in terms of quality assurance, in terms of products, you might be asking yourself, um, are these products good? Are they accredited? Let me tell you, ladies and gentlemen, the company has a 30 days money back guarantee in terms of the retaining of products. Now, if these products were not good in terms of customer satisfaction, if these products were not good, the company would have died a long time ago because people would be returning the products. The company is now 45 years old, which shows you that the products are good and they really, really work. Now, um, our products are accredited by the International Alu Science Council. Our products are also halal. This means that they can be consumed by Muslims. Do you know how difficult it is to get the halal certification on products? But we have that. And not only are our products consumed by Muslims as well, we actually also operate in Muslim countries. We all know how strict Muslims are. They do not just embrace and accept anything that goes against their beliefs. So again, I'm trying to show you that we are not part of a pyramid scheme. Now, what also made me partner with this company was the fact that we are distributing aloe vera products. Who doesn't know aloe vera? Everybody knows aloe. Everybody knows aloe has medicinal properties. Everybody knows that aloe is good in terms of one's health. So I loved the fact that even though I personally thought I cannot sell, I loved the fact that I was going to be recommending products that um, people are already familiar with, you know? So we all know aloe is good for our health. Internally, it supports a healthy digestive system, promotes a healthy immune system. It's good for nutrient absorption. You know, So it's really good in terms of your, your skin. If you know somebody that has a problem with eczema, with hair that is breaking and thinning, or with acne, aloe vera is absolutely good for that. Now, you might be asking yourself, okay, Kumo, we hear you, but do people really buy these products? Of course they do. If you partner with us, you would actually be in the right marketplace. And that is because currently globally, people are spending over 194 billion US dollars on vitamins and supplements. It's even more now since COVID because now people are more aware of the importance of taking nutritional supplements. In terms of weight management, people are spending a lot of money on weight gain and weight loss products. And we've got weight management products as well within our company. In terms of skincare, you know, when you go on TikTok, you're always seeing people plugging each other with different skincare products. What I can tell you is people will spend a lot of money to make sure that they have a good skin. And guess what, ladies and gentlemen, we've got skincare products as well within our company. We've got sports and nutrition products as well for people that go to gym. So we've got products that cover for everybody. This is a wide range of products, you can just decide what you want to focus on and run with that. So basically, what is it that we do in the business? We actually sell the products and we also introduce other people into the business and we coach them to also sell their products. That is because we will not be able to reach to their networks. So you expand your business by introducing other people to also sell these products. Now we all know that the best way to sell products is by actually using them. This is me. I'm not pregnant on this other picture. I just get very bloated because I can't digest certain foods properly. But aloe vera is very good for your digestive system. So when I consume it, as you can see on the other side, um, around the tummy area, my tummy has gone down. As you can see as well here, this is me as well. Now, ladies and gentlemen, even though I said I cannot sell, just by using these products and sharing my results with other people. Don't you think people will ask me what I used? That is exactly what we do, you know? So you might not have your own product testimony because you will be starting off 
But don't worry, we've got so many product testimonies that you can actually use to build your business while you also gather your own product testimony. This lady, it's that lady that I said is an accountant and she wanted to, to be able to provide for her daughter. Not only is she benefiting financially from this business, even health-wise, look at how overweight she used to be, but look at how much she lost with using the product. Don't you think when she shares this, people are asking her what she used? And look at this lady. She also just initially wanted to lose weight. Look at her before and after from using the products. This lady, look at her skin and look at how it now looks. Would you believe me if I told you that this lady, when she started the business, she was driving a Corsa Light. Again, there's absolutely nothing wrong with a Corsa Light. But you know she upgraded from a Corsa Light straight to a Range Rover. Who upgrades? That is a huge upgrade. You know, she skipped so many steps and went straight to a Range Rover. And not only that, when she started the business, she was not a property owner. But through the business, she is now a property owner and she paid off her property within five years of actually starting um of actually buying the property so ladies and gentlemen perhaps what we are sharing with you now might not really be your dream business but i want to say to you it can definitely fund your dreams and it can definitely even fund your dream businesses if you probably have deep dream other dream businesses and also um, just, you know, this lady, just by looking good like this, don't you think people ask her what she used? Look at this lady. She's Congolese, but she's also based in South Africa now. Look at how her skin used to look, you know, and look at how it now looks. Don't you think that even if you can't sell the fact that you've got such good results, people are going to ask you what you used? So now... Just to that was just to show you that the products are good and they work, ladies and gentlemen. So when you start the business, I don't want to dwell much into this marketing plan. That is because I don't want to confuse you. You will learn about the marketing plan and the compensation plan and how everything works when you are in the business. For tonight, I just want you to leave this meeting knowing that there's a there's a business opportunity that you can do that can really bring you a good extra income around your current commitments and career. But I will mention just the different levels um, on our marketing plan. So we've got a preferred customer level. That is the level where you are starting off. Then we've got assistant supervisor. We've got supervisor. We've got assistant manager. And we've got manager level. You know, these are different levels on our marketing plan. And... Um, I'm just going to skip other things because I'm looking at the time. So at supervisor level, you could potentially be making about 10,000 rents. Again, this is effort-based. It can be more. It can be less depending on the effort um, that are put in. But you are also buying products at 38% discount. And these are just some of the, the supervisors. Some of them are actually in this meeting. Um this lady, also a supervisor in the business, she is a nurse by profession. She's in Walvis Bay. The reason why she started the business was because she wanted to work on her retirement plan. So she's currently working on that. So this business is serving so many different purposes for different people. You can come in and probably have your own goals and have your own reason why you are starting it. And then, ladies and gentlemen, we've got assistant manager in the business. At assistant manager level, your potential income is just over 17000 Again, this is effort-based, but you're also buying products at 43% discount. And then we've got manager level, ladies and gentlemen. At manager level, your potential income is about 39,000 rands, and you're buying products at 48% discount. Now, I'm going to hand over to my wonderful, wonderful co-host, Veronica Kunja, my business partner, she's going to share with you the movements that we've had within our community for you to see that people are actually moving to these levels, you know. So let us celebrate these people as she introduces them 
and then she will carry on with the rest of the business presentation. But please be patient, ladies and gentlemen, because we will soon wrap up. Over to you, partner. Thank you so much, Kumo. Guys, are you inspired with all the stories that she has already shared? And I'll also share a number of stories as well. Um, but if you're a guest, can I get number 10? If you're a guest, can I see guest in here? Can you write number 10 as I'm continuing? Guys, I believe that you have been inspired and um, I will continue with this. And now I'm going to start with something very exciting. She has been sharing with us the levels that we have as some supervisor, supervisor. You'll have a team of about three to five people. So I'm going to recognize um, supervisor in both our teams that became supervisors in the month of November for you to know that if you're a guest tonight you have an opportunity to be able to become a supervisor by December or by January I mean this is the supervisor building business and so we definitely want you to become a supervisor as soon as possible now can you write number 15 if you want to be a supervisor in the next in December, actually. Can you write number 15 if you are our upcoming supervisor by December? Okay, so the very first um, supervisor. Do you guys want to see our supervisors, our brand new supervisors for the last month of October, of November? Do you guys want to see them? Can I see that? Yes, write number 15 if you want to see our, our supervisors. So the very first supervisor for the last month of November is none other than Elizabeth Shindy. Um, congratulations, Elizabeth Shindy. So this is to just inspire you as a guest guess to know that people actually achieve this you know and then we have got a brand new supervisor which is none other than victoria can umbu and then we also have got another brand new supervisor very excited one emeline bravo congratulations can i see the fires in there can i see the fires in there guys this shows that we are moving in both of our teams guys you are led you have got amazing leaders that can show you how you can get to where you want to go and we also have got none other than emilia wilford um all these people guys they have got jobs you know that they go every day you know as their full-time jobs and they still build the business part-time and then we do have got our brand new super Supervisor Tolastic Haufiku, congratulations. And then we also have our brand new supervisor, only two months in the business. She is a biochemist. Um, congratulations to you, Natasha Michelle. Super proud of you. And then we have got one brand new supervisor all the way from Canada. She lives in Canada and builds a business in Canada. And she is none other than Vimbai Murombo. Congratulations to you. And then we also have got our brand new supervisor. Yeah. So congratulations to you. So very proud of you guys. All these people could do it. If they could do it, you can do it as well. We have got our brand new supervisor, Pastor Tandy. Congratulations to you, Pastor Tandy. And then we do have got our brand new supervisor, Joyce Kungwane. So guys, are you excited? Can I see people that wants to become supervisors by end of December and say latest by January because you can. And then um, let's go to the next level, which is assistant manager, guys. We have got a brand new assistant manager and that is none other than Tangi Pena. So guys, when we say supervisor, it means someone has been able to unlock over 10,000 runs a month, okay? So on top of your salary, you're making that on top of your, you know, like income that you're already making. Now here, is an assistant man he has an assistant manager and um, she decided to quit her job she became a supervisor in just two months of her, of her business, starting the business you know now she's an assistant manager clocking manager this month she is a teacher by profession she decided to quit her job to just build this business i'm not saying you should quit your job no but she saw potential in this and she's building an amazing team and so congratulations to you tanki i don't see enough fires we are 100 but the fires are not enough if you know Tangi, you know she has been so excited with the business and I'm so very proud of you guys. You're not bringing in the energy in here. Can I see the energy? And then we also have got one excited. This lady is always smiling. Every time I meet her, she is super positive, super excited. And I was so happy to know that Stephanie, you are a, super, a brand new assistant manager. So very proud of you. I know that both of you are becoming managers by end of December. And then guys, after assistant manager, then obviously you are looking at becoming a, 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 becoming a manager. And assistant manager, sorry, assistant managers have been able to unlock 16,000 rands a month on top of, you, of their other incomes that they're making from other things that they're doing if they're building the business part-time. 
Now, when you become a, a super assistant manager, the next level is obviously manager, but not settling to manager, then you can't double your income by becoming an ego manager. So there is where the goal the goal is. But as a manager is unlocking about 40,000 runs a month. And last month, we actually had brand new managers. Guys, do you want to know our brand new managers? Are you excited to see our brand new managers? And the first um, the first brand new manager is none other than this hardworking woman that I know is none other than Frida Shikongo. So congratulations, Frida Shikongo, for unlocking manager in the month of November. Guys, this is where everybody is supposed to be and everybody can actually be. If you're a guest tonight, let me tell you, make a goal that 2024 doesn't end before you unlocking your 40,000 runs a month. I know it can be too good to be true, but people unlock this and people make these incomes. And so you can also do the same. Now we have got our brand new manager from Team Wealth. And this is none other than my amazing Dr. Precious Matenda. She is a medical doctor and building the business part-time. And so she also became a brand new manager last month. So guys, if they can do it, you can do it as well. Let me see the fires in there. And then our last brand new manager who unlocked 40,000 runs a month um, as a forever business owner is none other than Fikile Nkwinika. Congratulations, my leader. She lives in South Africa, but last month, this month, actually, she came all the way to Namibia, you know, because she's a serious business builder. And so I'm so very happy to see you as a manager. Now, when you become a manager, next thing that you're supposed to do is to help other people become managers. So don't just settle when you become a manager. You're a guest start as an assistant supervisor, go supervisor, go manage, go assistant manager, go manager, and then help other people become managers. If you are here and you're unlocking 40,000, then you're helping Helping another person unlock 40,000 forever is actually adding you another 15,000. If the two of you help another person become a manager and unlock 40,000 as well, forever is adding you 7,000 while it's adding this one another 15,000. Okay, if the three of you help this one become manager, you are unlocking another 5,000 on top of all this. And then this one is unlocking 15,000 and this one is unlocking 7,000. So it's a winning situation, guys. So don't ever think that you'll be alone because it is the job of the person that invited you in this meeting to help you become a manager. But of course, if you don't join, we will keep on doing the business. We'll keep on helping other people become managers. So when you join the business, I want you to know that you're joining and doing the business for yourself. So you can, when you hear like I'm making 70,000, 100,000, 200,000, I'm a six figures earner. It's because of the number of managers that you will create. Okay. So now after you become a manager, the next level that you're going to is a senior manager. Well, I'm looking about 1.1 million a year. Guys, that is an in incredible income. And then the soaring manager, um, that is about 2 million a year. And then Sapphire manager, that's about 3.5 million a year. And you go on. Now, guys, um, we have got a brand new senior manager for the last month of November. Do you guys want to know who has now, you know, um, going to be unlocking over 1.1 million runs a year? This lady has been able to pay off her debt. I've been able to do so much. You're going to hear a number of her stories as we go on. Guys, do you want to see our senior manager? Do you want to see our senior manager for the month of November, guys? Yes, let me see the fires in there. Guys, if you're a guest, this is how we're going to be celebrating you every step of the way. We want to see you breaking, you know, um, your own records every single month. And our brand new manager, senior manager for the last month of November is none other than our very, very, very own, um, very own, Mariana Hilarius. Well, I posted a poster here that doesn't have a name, but her name is Mariana Hilarius. Congratulations, Mariana. You have been breaking your own records every single month. Every single month. This lady is just 33 years of age, but within that time, and she's in business for only 23 months. She's not even a year, two years, sorry. So she's lock, um, clocking two years this month of December. And imagine within that two, two, um, two years, meaning 23 months, she is now a senior manager. She has been a top manager in, in Namibia for the longest time that I know. She has traveled for free to Dubai, traveled for free to uh, Bangkok, to Pattaya. You know, um, she has been able to pay off her debt within 23 months, guys. So if you're a guest tonight, I want to inspire you and tell you that if all these people could do it, you also can be able to do it. 
Now, you can also be able to unlock another income on top of your monthly income as a manager, and we call it a forever to drive, where forever is paying you 6.2 um, every month for the next 36 months, or 9.3 or 12.4 every single month for the next 36 months. And of course, this, you know, most people get to buy cars, but then you can do anything with that money because it comes as, a, as money. So you can pay off your car, you can pay off your mortgage, you can use it to pay school fees, you can use to save and have emergency funds, you can use it for your retirement plan, whatever that you want to do, because this comes as money. And um, you can also qualify this from any country. So I've just qualified myself um, for another um, car plan in South Africa. Our, our senior manager here kumo actually soaring manager you know um to come to be you know i'm just i mean like by now of course you know just because of the system and all that but she's definitely a soaring manager um she is a level two car plan qualifier level two guys and that is no joke no joke so guys if we can do it you definitely can do it you see people here are, 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 are carrying the yellow bottles you know, yellow bottles here. I mean, you you look at these yellow bottles and be like, ah, you know, I can't sell, as, as Kumo was saying. But I'll tell you, if yellow bottles can help you drive this car, she's been talking about all these upgrades people have been having. It's not about just cars. Guys, people do, oh, uh, this is Kumo again. She's driving a brand, and she bought this car over a million, and she bought it, um, she bought it during COVID. You know, during COVID, when people were losing their jobs, people were losing businesses, you know, people were losing incomes. Kumo Mwase was actually living her best life, you know, and just upgraded her car from Mercedes to another Mercedes, which was even better. And she's also carrying a yellow bottle. So if you think like, oh, I'll be selling, I can't sell, or, you know, and especially as Kumo was saying, most people, you know, relate selling with, with poverty. Guys, look at all these amazing people, you know, look at all these amazing people. So why don't we choose to be true to ourselves? People do buy homes because of the business. This lady that you see here, this house is in actually in Cape Town, and she was able to pay off her, uh, her house or her mortgage for her family within four years of building the business. So if people in this side are actually buying homes using the business, then why are you sitting there and say you can't? We are entering another new year, 2024. Do you want this 2024 to, 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 to end just like the way 2023 is ending if you're a guest? Obviously, you can be better. If you're already a forever business owner, my mission, you know, I've written it down. I'm going to present it to you um, soon, is to have more people pay off their debts within the team, to have more people pay off their cars or buy cars if you don't have a car. Um, 2024, guys, it's more people buying properties. We do have good people. I mean, one of them doesn't want me to share to, uh, today, but um, you will get to see people within us you know, are doing some amazing things. So if all these people could do it, guys, you also can be able to do it. I remember buying this car at age 28 and 20, I'm, I'm saying 28 because it's incredible, you know? And in my country, we don't have any car finance or anything. So I remember buying this car at, you know, we bought it cash, 1.4 million rands cash at age 28. And I think it's a big deal because if it wasn't for this business, there's no way I would have been employed and become a, a director or a CEO at age 28. There's no, you know, like that doesn't happen, okay? Unless if it's your own company and probably if you have, you know, gotten all these godfathers that are helping you, but you know in our community is not as usual. And so I'm so grateful forever that we've been able to accomplish so many things, including this, which we bought it cash, you know? It's incredible. So guys, I don't know why you're here. I don't know what your goals are, but I will tell you that you can be able to achieve your goals. If you are, one of your goals in 2024 is to travel the world, then well, you can be able to travel the world. I remember in 2014, my husband and I traveled in 14 countries in one year. In 2015, my husband and I traveled in 15 countries in one year. For me, traveling is a goal. For me, traveling is is is, is something that I don't take lightly. You know, um, just like when when we the the, the, the um the borders opened after COVID, we the, the same year when the borders opened, that was last year. Yeah, we did not a year before, a year before last year, we did about eight countries within that year. You know, so I know if it wasn't for forever, I wouldn't be saying all this. I wouldn't be having, you know, in all these amazing places. This was the last time we went to New York. And that was our seventh time to just to, to, to go to the U.S. And USA is not a country that you just go. Visa are always a problem, but we have been doing that. I remember before moving to South Africa, my husband and I were coming here almost every year to just do shopping and go back. 
And I will tell you, Forever have, has funded so much of that. Now, I've not just been traveling alone. You know, now I'm traveling with my kids. And I will tell you, this makes me feel so fulfilled. You know, because I remember, you know, boarding my plane for the first time I was I was already I was already like this, you know, but now they are getting to enjoy and get to be exposed to the world when they are young. And I don't take this for granted. This is Marianne and her mom, you know, just the other day. These are my kids. These are the people that introduced me to the business. So imagine today we have been inviting you on this Zoom and there's a day you'll be sitting like this. You know, this is Kumo Mwase, you know, the one, my partner that was just presenting here. So you'll be sitting with people that invited you in this meeting, some countries, I don't know where, we'll be celebrating you somewhere. We'll be ce celebrating when you buy your first car. We'll be celebrating when you buy your home. We'll be celebrating, we'll be traveling with you. So don't take these things for granted. And um, ego manages an incentive that you obviously want to get into. Guys, if you're here, we have got an ego manager coming and starting up in May next year. We have got five months. So if you're an FBO, become a manager by April, Make sure you become a manager by April and then, then you can be able to start working on your ego manager 2024. And just the other year, we, we traveled to Pattaya. But this is me and Kumo and Mariana when we met her for the first time in Rundu. And this is us, you know, Mariana being an ego manager. And she's now a senior manager, actually. And this, we took the same picture. Remember here, we were the three of us. We took the same picture in Pattaya. You know, so that's what I'm saying. We'll be celebrating. We'll work with you, but we'll also celebrate you um, when you're growing in the business. This is was us um, with Team Team Tanzania. Kumo is here. Mariana is here, and some other leaders and plus my sponsors. You will be uh, you you will be among people. You know, over one thousand people. And next year we'll be going to India, guys. Can you write India if you want to go to India? If you're going to India, you know, next year we'll be going to India in April, and we'll be meeting probably over fifty thousand people. Forever will be making history. In India, so you definitely can be able to enjoy these global travels. For Mariana, for example, she was able to travel with her mom. The story is just incredible because her mom, at age sixty, she never thought that she'd be traveling the world and you know boarding a plane and go for a holiday at age sixty. Now think. How can you reward your parents? How can you reward people that you love? It doesn't have to be your parents, but imagine if your parents are there. You know, sometimes we don't even pick, you know, people don't even pick their, their parents' calls because you, you know they are looking for money or they're asking for money and you cannot even offer them. But here's an opportunity where you can be able to reward them for their hard work and for raising you, you know, and in an amazing way like this, you know? So this is me and my, Mariana's daughter and this is my daughter's. You know, I mean, the view of the hotel we were was with Kumo, you know, so it's incredible. This is me and some other, you know, um, FBOs, forever business owners with their kids. And this is Kumo as well. You can see here how it has been amazing. You understand? Um, So it, if, if all these people could do it, I believe you also can be able to do it, guys. I believe you can also be able to do it. Mariana bought a car when she was just a supervisor. You know, she traveled to Dubai when she was just a supervisor. You know, this is, you can see, I remember last year, uh, no, a year before, last, a year before, no, last year, don't even, yeah, last year, you know, I had an opportunity to stand in front of over 1,000 people invited by our president of the company, um, Aiden, um, you know, and I remember everything was fully paid for because I was an ego manager, ego senior manager, actually, and um, we flew from South Africa to, you know, to, to Cancun, Mexico, um, via New York, and everything was fully paid for us. And then on top of that, guys, I was called on stage as the only African girl. And I don't take this for granted. I always share this, always, until I hit another global stage, you know? It is my my hope that there's a day I will be emceeing in one of the global forever global rallies. I mean, it is one of my goals and dreams. If that happened, that is when I'll stop sharing this. But for me, this is incredible. And I know, um, you know, you know, just sharing how is it that we do in the business. So I, I'm telling you, you are led. If you're a guest tonight, I'm encouraging you to take the leap of faith and say, you know what, I want to do this. These are some ladies that we traveled with to, to, to Egypt last year. And, um, um, you know, some of them, actually like this lady, Constantia, was in business for only four months. Only four months in the business. This is uh, Takatu. She's a registered nurse. She decided to quit her job. You know, you can see we went to Dubai again. This is a this is a accountant, um, rich chartered accountant that is now building the business full time from South Africa. You know, um, you can see like people have been really enjoying life before because of forever. This lady is probably part of the meeting tonight, and she is 50, 51 years of age right now, and she never thought that she'll be traveling at age fifty. But here she is, you know, in a kimono, um, cruising somewhere in Dubai. So guys, I don't know what your goals are, 
But I'm encouraging you that if you're here in this meeting, you're not here by chance. This lady, we were in Dubai with her. And when she started the business, she started the business the same year. This was in 2022, last year. She started the business in January last year. And this was in October last year. That is about what? Nine months later, right? And then her income, she was already a manager. Her income in September was 40,000. Her income in October, that month that we were in Dubai was 40, 000, so 39,000. So can you imagine January starting the year, the, the business, and within nine months, you're already unlocking 40,000 incomes. And then on top of that, you've already traveled the world. I don't know how your 2024 is going to be, but that is a choice that you need to make for yourself, you know? And so um, this is the first person that say, said yes to my business or to joining my team and starting, you know, Southern Africa. She's called Kumo. She was really struggling with paying school fees, rent for her family, for her kids. She's a single mom of three, but here she is in Dubai. But on top of that, um, Gwen lost her job in 2021. I think 2021, and she decided to build a business full time. And I told Gwen, let's do the business. And she decided to say yes. When we started this year in, in, in 2023, she was able to pay school fees for all of her three kids for the whole year once for all of the three, something that she was struggling, despite the fact that she had a job that she was she had been working on for 10 years. She has been struggling with paying rent, but today she's even thinking like, you know what, I've been able to do a lot, you know, like covering all my debts and all that. She's now looking for a car. She's now, you know, like I, I know she's aiming so much. She's already having businesses in, in Canada. I've, 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 I've um, um, recognized the lady that became a supervisor in Canada. That's her team that, that, she, that she met on Facebook, you know? And um, she has businesses in, 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 in Germany. She's almost raising a manager in Germany. She has businesses in Zimbabwe. She has businesses in, in, in the UK, in the US. All these are first world countries, you understand? And she is building the business using Facebook, you know? And here she is in Abu Dhabi. And I took this picture and asked Gwen, when we were sitting the other day, talking about forever, did you ever think that we'll be sitting like somewhere here in Dubai? She said, in Abu Dhabi, she said, no. So that's what I'm saying. If you're a guest tonight, let me encourage you that you can be able to do this. And there was a day you'll be saying, you know what? Thank you to the person I invited you in this meeting because you will be celebrating some of your goals. You can also qualify for checks. Kumo here has been ever since she started here. How many checks? There are five checks. And she's been in business for only seven years. And within those seven years, she has qualified for five checks, meaning you are getting your monthly income, but end of the year forever is saying, congratulations, you, you have been working so tirelessly and we're going to share part of, of part of that, part of part of the profits. So guys, how amazing is that? So you're getting your monthly income because I know, I know in our jobs, um, you know, we, we do work a lot, but then you don't get to be recognized, you know, live along being recognized by being paid more money, you know? So I know she has gone through the products, so I'm not going to go through that, but I will tell you, I've got amazing products and this is myself. I was told at age 29, very your diabetic, very your cholesterol is not okay. You know, at age 29, I was like, I have got two kids by then. I was overweight, you can see here. And so I decided to use the programs that um, Forever has, the weight loss program within about um, nine days. So we have got a program called Clean Nine. And within about, um, this is the Clean Nine. And within about um, nine days, because it's a nine days program, within about nine days, I was able to lose 5.3 kilos. Within a month, I was able to lose 10 kilos. Within three months, I was able to lose 18 kilos. And I've been able to maintain this weight from here to here for over five years until I got pregnant with my last born. And right now, I'm hitting the gym again to make sure that I'm getting back to the sexy mama. You know, I'll be like, I've carried four kids, guys. Four kids. I've got three kids. One was a, was a stillborn, but four full pregnancies. But I intend... I intend to look like a 20 years of old girl. And I know we have got these amazing products for skin. We've got amazing products for weight. We've got amazing products for, you know, building muscles and all that. So I know that we can all do that. You just, as, as Kumo said, you just need to become a product of a product. So we're not going to go into detail about the products, but she has already at least touched up a bit about that in the category that we have. You can obviously go back to the person that invited you in this meeting and they can share more on that. How can you, uh, you know, who will buy the products? If that is your question, because that is the question that most people are asking, how do I sell? So it's like everybody needs the product. So everybody, literally everybody, the demand of the products is so high. As Kumo said, you just need to become a product of a product. How can you start the business? Um, you just need to buy your combo. Combo is the easiest. 
and the cheapest um, into becoming into becoming a full member. And so most people will start, sorry, I've not updated this, but most people will start with 6,000. Now it's 6,500 actually. And so just become a full member because that's the cheapest way. Of course, as Kumo said, you can start with as minimum as 1,000, but you know, I don't encourage that because for you to start, if you start with that package, the, the quarter package, you are opting for 9.3, while there's an option of 6.5 and that becomes, you know, becomes cheaper, okay? Or this is the quarter stock and this is the half stock. Okay, but I also encourage people to start with this. We call it a supervisor plan in our team where you'll be starting with 18,000. But if you do this, it means we'll sit down and make a plan for you to get to supervise as soon as possible, you know? So you will go back, the person invited you in this meeting and you can be able to see how you can be able to, how you can be able to start and how you can be able to, um, to, to, to grow your business. Does it sound too good to be true? I understand it does. It doesn't I I personally feel like it is too good to be true. I did not have the money to start. I had to go borrow money. I was so worried. You know, I was a student. I was like, who will I sell the products to? But I will tell you, if you're gonna put in the time and efforts that is required to build a business, if you're ready to be coached in the business, you will definitely be able to get to where you want to go. So the most important thing is to think of your goals. And I know you must be having all these questions. I can't sell, I can't talk to people, I don't have enough capital, all this. Let me go ask my spouse, you know, and all that. Let me go ask my friend. I will tell you, if you have a goal here and you're about to enter 2024, don't ever let fear, guilt, you know, past failure forbid you from starting over. Don't let a person, whether it's your spouse, you know, I'm married for almost what, 12 years. And I will tell you the one that I always do when I want to start something that I believe in. I'm like, you know, baby, I am just asking for your support. Let me explore this myself. I will need your support 100%. If I fail, that will be my failure because some things we're just called ourselves. It's not your spouse that is called for this, you know? So if it's a wife or a husband, just ask them for support to just let you try it but if it's a boyfriend if it's a friend guys if it's a girlfriend don't ever even listen you know in fact i will tell you if it will need you to quit some cycles of people that you have quit on them because 2024 will need you to be on the driver's seat it will need you to make a decision it will need you to step up even in your mindset and i want you to join our community because we're gonna give you the support that you need and i want you to encourage you that if you're here as i said it is not by chance the same god that brought you in this meeting is the same god that is gonna it's gonna bring you customers it's gonna bring you the team that you need it's gonna help you build your business so have faith set sit down set your goals and we will show you how you can be able to do it we have for trainings we have for you know trainings um every every 12 you know sorry um noon every 12 hours yeah every noon in the afternoon weekday weekdays we have got sessions in the 5 a.m sessions we have got sessions of, of you know like um that already recorded on youtube we have got podcasts we have got apps we have got all everything that you actually need for you to be able to equip yourself for the business so you just need to say yes and say you know what I am ready to start the business and show me how to do it. So at this particular time, I would love to welcome in our family, in our community of people that we are really building ourselves and very serious when it comes to our goals. And we hope that you have good goals that you want to achieve, not just for you guys. The decision that, you, the decision that you're going to make right now is not just for you. It's going to be for your kids. It's going to be for your sports. It's going to be for your family. It's going to be for people that you don't even know at this particular time because how we grow in network marketing, as Kumo shared, is that we gonna, we share with each other, you know, regardless of who that is. And because of social media, you will meet people that you don't even know. You know, that they will be part of your family. They'll be part of your community and will be growing together. So you will be a torch bearer for so many people. There'll be so many people that'll be saying, you know what? Thank you. Let me see who is here. There'll be so many people that will be saying, thank you, Aune. Thank you, Bonang. Thank you, Bravo. Thank you, Caroline. You know, um, thank you for showing me how, you know, thank you, Elvis. You know, I was looking for a gentleman here, you know, that will be, you know, they'll be thanking you for showing them this opportunity as you're also building your own goals, as you're also achieving your goals. So I wish you all great success on the next week that is coming. I know this is end of the year. This is December. But if you're a new person and you're a guest, don't say I'm going to start January because January January is not the month to start a business. Now is the month to start a business. Now is the month that you need to make a decision because right now your people are in the spending mood. Your people that are going to buy your products for you to get your return on investment are in the spending mood. They are waiting for you to show them how and you know what gifts they can gift other people. 
They are waiting for you to show them how they're going to lose weight in January, how they're going to start over. You know, there are people right now, they're looking forward into having an amazing 2024. Now is the time people are setting their goals. They will join your business now. So you don't wait to start in January. Rather, you start today, you start now, and then we show you how you can be able to maximize and make money in January. So that's when it comes to February, you won't be like someone that was in this meeting and you'll be broke just like everybody else. You shouldn't be broke in January if you're in this meeting. You shouldn't struggle in paying rent. You shouldn't struggle in paying school fees in January if you're in this meeting. So um, join our business and we'll show you how you can be able to start achieving your goals from now and have an amazing 2024. Thank you all very much and wish you all great, great, great success um, in month of December in 2024. Please go back to the person who invited you in this meeting. And once again, congratulations to our brand new supervisors, our brand new assistant manager, and brand new managers, and our brand new senior manager. And a very special um, thank you to my partner, my friend Kumo Mwase for this evening. So I wish you all great success once again and bye-bye everyone.